Hello lovelies, it's Lex and welcome back to Fable 2. We are on our way to Westcliff doing the like arena, going to the arena kind of thing. And oh, I stopped right before that thing I was just talking about where you have to fight a bunch of bandits. <laughs> Take it down, Hammer! Doesn't look that tough. Yeah. Good, good. Stand and fight, you cowardly knaves. Knaves. Ooh, that's a good word. Alright. Let's get him, Hannah. Hannah is, like, actually a really useful helper. I hate when you have, like, an NPC follower and they suck. She actually does stuff. It's nice. Oh my god, just fucking stab him! Push down with a weapon drawn low. No, no, no. I don't want to turn off safety mode. I don't want to kill Hannah. I hear gargoyle. There we go. Alright. There's definitely some chests and stuff here. More guys. Okay, just all right. Dig spot, dig spot. Let's dig, doggy dog. Okay, go on. There we go. So I heard a gargoyle, and I'm sure there are some treasure chests and stuff around here. Because there's gotta be. Oh, there's one. And I hear that gargoyle. I think he's... There's a tower I'm pretty sure you can go up into. Oh, a highwayman coat. Cool. Yeah, so there's the tower. I think the gargoyle's up there. And then we'll have to go explore all around, too. There's Maybe there's a key or something up here. Treasure chest. Money! All right, where is this gargoyle? Oh! I see you. All right, did. There you are. Boop. So let's go back down here. All right. So that's where we came in. I didn't go over here yet. Oh, treasure chest. Oh, a ruby. You can't go up into these little towers anymore, which makes me kind of sad, because you, you could go up them in Fable 1. Oh, here's another treasure chest. I knew there was a bunch of shit over here. Same as... Oh, it's the same bow I have. All right, I think that's it for here. Good deal. Onward! So maybe this episode we'll fight the Balverines. I know I said last episode we were going to fight them, but that was a lie. All right, now we're actually I've in Westcliff. Stories about Westcliff. Places have been infested with Balverines. I heard this one story about these traders who attacked. Balverines killed both parents. Worse than my longsword. Okay. Resurrection file. Resurrection the kids file. Survived. 
A slaver found the poor things, took them back to his camp, and locked them up in a cage. That night, the kids turned, broke out of the cage, and ripped every slaver in the camp to shreds. It makes you think, doesn't it? I wonder if I actually have... I might have... Oh, wait. I know I have a couple augments. I don't think I have a silver augment, though. Bewitching make you more attractive. And then slash and burn is a fire one. All right. So we do not have a silver augment. So let's see how this goes. Come on. Oh. Hammer, they're cute. No, it didn't. It's gonna jump down on us. No, there they are. Gotcha. Like Balverines. I've spent my whole life praying, and meanwhile, the world was just as dangerous as ever. Now, this stretch of road is a little bit safer because of us. Nothing. Yeah, I, I like Balverines. I think they're super interesting. I think they're a really, I think they're a really neat take on, on a werewolf. Oh. He can get a couple good hits in on him. They're not necessarily that hard to kill. Much easier if you have a silver augment, which I'm hoping might be in this chest here. And I heard a gargoyle, so we'll have to see if we can find him. Wizard hat. Ooh. Oh, I see ya. Oh, wait. And then let's take one of those... Let's take one of those potions and see if it's like, let's take the skill potion. No, maybe you don't get no bonus experience. Okay, so you do get bonus for it. So I do need to wait until I get a decent little combo going and then use it. Okay. Looking for stuff. I'm looking for stuff. There's our girl. We sort of help her. Come on. I really would rather not help her. Every lady out in the woods for themselves. Hello. Right. Balverines attacked us. They killed my husband. They killed my Frederick. It's all Frodrick? With us. They took my son. Can you show us where they took him? I... I think so. Alright, yeah. We'll go that way in a minute. First, we're going up here. Because I'm pretty sure I saw a gargoyle. I'm sure your son's dead. Your son's dead. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm crazy. Health potion! Oh, I hear you. I see you. Well, that's not gonna work. Excuse me, ladies.
Move! Oh my god. Whee! I hope this was not the wrong choice. Is there something back here? Oh, that's a missed opportunity there. Oh, there's a dive spot. Money! Now I gotta figure out how to get back up. Oh, maybe there's something back here that I just went past. What is this little alcove here? There we go. Where the shit am I? There we go. Oh, all right, I'm somewhere. Where is Hammer? Oh, am I all the way back at where I started? All right, we can get back up there really quick though, it's fine. They're like right here, there they are. It was an adventure! A treasure, you say? A key! Excuse me! Oh, I don't have enough keys. What way does she want us to go? This way. That one probably wants you to have sex with a bunch of people. And have a bunch of drinks. There's usually always a demon door that's like that. <laughs> a demon door of debauchery. Move, bitch! Get out the way! No, let's look like I can get over there. Or get up there. What's over here? A lot of nothing. Not even a gargoyle. We're doing pretty decent on the gargoyles, though. Oh, fuck off! There, I'm fine now. Everything's fine. Oh, was there more down there? Eh. We'll check it out later. Oh. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Oh, I see something down here. Dog, I'm better at finding treasure than you are. A potion! Move! Oh my god. And this is why I hate NPCs. <gasps> Valverines! I hear you. Why are they attacking us? Where are you? Oh, 
I see you, I see you, I see your eyes. Pretty necklace. And then looks like nothing. So I really want to end this episode here and start this portion as its own episode, but I'm not going to just because this one um, is too short. <laughs> so depending on how our time goes, you won't let anything happen to him, will you? I'll You'll shut. Save him. Oh my god, you're lucky I don't fucking kill you right now. Robert's fine. You've got to be careful. Why the road has to go through a place like this is beyond me. Couldn't they have cut down a few trees instead? So depending on how our time goes on this one, I may or may not most likely will be splitting the Howling Halls into another episode too, unfortunately. I've timed this out poorly. You know what? This happened sooner than I thought it would, so we're fine. Children, I bring you flesh. Oh my god, Lilith was evil the whole time. I knew it. Oh, Jesus. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where's my sword? Why did that, like, unequip? That was fucking weirdo. Time now, Hannah. We should maybe get some bonus XP from these. Let's see. Let's take the strength potion. She's right. Show no mercy and get out of that place quickly. I can't see any way across that pit. Knock one of these over. There must be something we can do. There is, I just told you. know if I got bonus XP for that or not but I'm just gonna use the other one now too because I'm gonna I'm gonna forget that I have them there we go yeah I did all right so I got bonus XP for the one thing but not the other one whatever yeah I killed your babies Lilith what do you think about that you white Valverine bitch! I bet Frederick wasn't even your husband! Liar! Haha, <laughs> you're dead. Oh. 
Gotcha. Thank you. Why can't I go over it? Yeah, I'm trying to freaking leave, you dumb. Got that gargoyle before he even yelled at us. So since this quest was like really similar to the when you first see the Balverines in um in Fable One, I was never like surprised that Lilith was bad. I actually was kind of like, oh really? You're just gonna do that like same thing again? Okay, whatever, but it was still interesting to fight a white Balverine that early in the game the first time I played this, because usually, like, you don't fight the white Balverine in one, um, or you don't fight the white Balverine in one until you get to Knothole Glade. So that was actually, like, really surprising that they threw a, a white Balverine in that early, but, um, yeah, I like, I like how they did it. I think it makes it fun. Doggy, where are you? Show me the treasure! Oh, there it is. We may actually almost be done with the Howling Halls. Maybe I'll see how much farther it's going here. Oh yeah, I think we're pretty much done with the Howling Halls. Let's check out all this stuff, because some of these little alcoves have, like, a little room, I think. Maybe not. I heard my dog bark, though. What, doggy? Oh, there was a little alcove. I thought so. I really like the music in the Howling Halls, too. I like this, this music that they have here. I don't think they'll follow us into the light. We were quite a team back there, weren't we? Sure. The Balverine buggers didn't stand a chance. You see, this is what I'm talking about. We just did a load more good than all the prayers I've said in my whole life. All right. Well, I think that this is a good place to end this episode. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this playthrough of Fable 2. I hope everybody has a wonderful rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching. And I will see everybody later on.